Sirius star Matt Roloff rents the family home on his $4 million farm on Airbnb, and Jacob is settling into his part of the farm. Watch to the end for details. We learn about Matt's shocking decision to rent out the famous house, as the renowned farm has been on the market for more than 160 days. An insider at Roloff Farms revealed that the high-profile announcement was made to visitors last week. Matt revealed the exciting news during a Q&A at an autograph session. When curious fans began asking about the fate of the famous family home and land for sale, Matt shared that he decided to list the house on Airbnb for rent. Matt revealed that due to significant delays at the permit office, the house has not been able to host guests for 26 weeks. Roloff hopes to have Airbnb rentals up and running by next pumpkin season. Tour guides at the farm also told of the joyous event. As workers led patrons around the perimeter of the big house, they were finally allowed to share special news from the past week. They had to keep the secret under wraps for the first half of the pumpkin season, as the house's transformation into an Airbnb will be one of the main storylines for the upcoming LPBW season, which begins on November 1st. As fans walked by the house during the tour, they saw workers going in and out of the house to freshen it up for future guests. A substantial green sign was posted in front of the house, coming soon, short-term rentals. While the Airbnb construction is underway, Jacob and his wife Isabel have moved into a house on Fifth Wheel on a private plot of land with an active building next to the roll of farms. Jacob and Isabel live on the farm full-time. They had previously rented, and while living on the farm, they saved money. Fifth Wheel homes can cost anywhere from $36,000 to $135,000, depending on the size and amenities. A source claims that the crafty couple is considering converting the boss into their temporary home. It is unknown at this time whether construction is underway on Jacob and Isabel's private land for the future family home in which they will settle, or whether Matt's youngest son is simply living nearby until a farmer can find a buyer. Jacob and Isabel live there to save money and help on the farm. The rest of the family doesn't mind because Matt and Karen get along well. According to a second insider, Matt and his girlfriend Karen Chandler help with their 10-month-old baby Mattel while Jacob works on the farm and Isabel greets fans. While working on the farm, Amy keeps her distance from her ex-husband while he greets fans, and her new husband Chris Merrick also helps with Mattel. Isabel is generous with her time and allows all fans to stop, chat and get to know her adorable baby boy. During her lunch break, Isabel goes to the farm to eat on the grass with Jacob and then takes Mattel back to the camper for a nap after the hard work of greeting fans. Jacob works hard on the farm and does not take his father's generosity for granted. Jacob cuts firewood, runs a pumpkin farm, hauls work tools on the farm tractor, and more. When Jacob turned 25 this January, Matt gave him a prized family heirloom to reward his youngest son for his hard work on the farm. Fans decided that Jacob inheriting Matt's bright yellow retro car might be another sign that he would be the son to take over the farm. While Jacob has moved into his father's side, his older twin brothers Zach and Jeremy have refused to show up during pumpkin season, the busiest time of year in the family. Although Jeremy and their new estate are only a 10-minute drive from the Roloff Farms, he doesn't show up to help out during the season. Meanwhile, Zach shocked fans at the beginning of the summer by announcing that he would not be helping the family during pumpkin season amid his animosity with Matt. Thanks for watching. Good luck to the Roloffs. Good luck to my dear viewers.